Well, this is it, an occasion of true grandeur. The date has been ringed in red for months now, and the stage is set here on the Spanish capital for the UEFA Champions League final. My name is Derek Ray, my co-commentator to help describe all the action is, of course, Lee Dixon, and we're fast approaching kickoff time here at the magnificent Estadio Metropolitano. It's Barcelona up against Juventus. Good evening, what a pleasure it is to be here with you, Derek, sitting over this magnificent stadium with arguably the best two teams, well, obviously the best two teams in this competition this year, because they're in the final, and what a final we've got. The pitch looks fantastic, the crowd are expecting, there's the trophy. Just sitting there, and the players in the tunnel, just about to do what they do best, go out and play and entertain us. is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-Andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Samuel Umtiti starts alongside Piquet in the middle of the defence. Ivan Rakitic plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And Luis Suarez will be the main striker here. With a capacity of almost 68,000, this is a fine football stadium, the Metropolitano here in Madrid. Yeah, I'm very envious of these modern players. They get to play in these really beautiful, beautiful new stadiums. And the starting lineup for Juventus. Wojciech Szczesny between the posts. Juan Cuadrado starts with Douglas Costa in the wide positions. And leading the attack today is the heart to contain Cristiano Ronaldo. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. And a throw in forthcoming. Costa with it. It's going to be a free kick for Juventus. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? Corner for Juve. Now, what can he do here? Suarez. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. For a counter to succeed, it has to happen at lightning pace. It didn't. I always think it's impossible, Lee, not to be moved when you're covering Barcelona in the UEFA Champions League, as the club motto tells you, mesh, Kate one club, more than just a football club. Well, you feel that as soon as you come into the stadium, don't you? Even if the team's not playing particularly well, the fans let you know that they're here to support those famous Barcelona shirts, and they do it week in, week out. A free-kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. Messi giving it away, not really like him. He has plenty of support. And it's with Coutinho. Here's Ronaldo. Ivan Rakitic. Juventus have given it away. Luis Suarez making progress with the ball at his feet. Coutinho. And it's Vidal. Lionel Messi. 
Coutinho. Not sure it'll be dull. Can they get themselves in front here? Dybala just couldn't keep it. Over the touchline for a throw-in. And Barca's corner. And the short option preferred. Providing the cross, Coutinho. Well, great read there to intercept. And a very good challenge. Ronaldo! A goal for the Bianconeri. Goal for Juventus in the Champions League final. Well, finals of the heroes. Is that the goal that lifts the trophy? We'll wait and see. Well, let's see that again. Once he gets into his stride, he just strolls past players. What a lovely solo, wonderful effort this is. A chance to revisit the goal. And they're back playing again. Juve with the lead here. Now here's Arturo Vidal, Lionel Messi. Pjanic now. Goalkeeper's ball and was always going to be. It's with Dybala. Cristiano Ronaldo. Juventus, the old lady, they know how to keep the ball. What can they do from here? And it might be Douglas Costa. Want to get high marks for that move, but they couldn't make it count. Now Busquets. Bonucci. Pjanic. And given away. And it's Vidal. And Messi. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Given away by Ronaldo. Ronaldo untidy with the ball. Well, they've jumped in front, Lee. That's the most important thing. Your assessment so far? Well, this is going well for Juve. Just, it's tight. Control the ball is key when a game is like this. They have the players to do it for sure, though. But they'll be the happier of the two teams at half-time. Sergio Roberto. He has teammates to play it to. Not sure it'll be down. Lionel Messi. Excellent challenge. A throw in forthcoming. And it's Vidal. We have the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. And then with a real chance, only the keeper to beat. And a goal here for Juventus. Surely there's to lose now. Well, look at it again. I do question the defenders, but let's give credit to him. What a wonderful solo effort. And he still has the presence of mind to finish it off. What a brilliant solo goal. So, 2-0 now. Rakitic has lost it here. It's a measured pass in the general direction of Paolo Dybala. Cristiano Ronaldo. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Dybala. And now Ronaldo. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. And turned onto the woodwork. Keeper did his job to begin with. And here he is.
is Mandzukic. Just straying offside. Given away by Barcelona. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Well, regaining possession for his side, cleverly. Good-looking attack launched by Ronaldo here. Now here's Arturo Vidal. Half time in the Champions League final. Well, we're not quite at the stage where we're tracking the record margin of victory in a major European final, but not far away, Lee. Well, we were expecting a lot more, weren't we? A lot more competitive football. We haven't had that very, very one sided. Now, the coach, go into that dressing room and earn your money. Get your team back into this. Change something. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is... Into the second half then in this battle for Champions League glory. Tackle crisp and accurate. Alexandro now. Janic. Just dig it. It's an unbelievable save. Corner coming up for Juventus. Now Jordi Alba. Rakitic on the ball. Juve throw in forthcoming. Given away. Beautifully timed. Well, the story surrounding Cristiano Ronaldo is usually a positive one, and tonight, no exception. Well, I've got a word for that first half performance. Spectacular. He was absolutely brilliant. He's got his two goals. Let's see what he's got to offer in the second half. Costa with it. Here's Ronaldo. That's an example of how you should do it. Samuel Umtiti. The Blaugrana have given the ball away. Ronaldo! And that's what the Bianconeri wanted. A goal for Juventus crowd have gone crazy and quite rightly so what a finish that is well let's see that one again it's all about the contact does everything right he's not bothered where the goal is he knows where it is he gets a beautiful strike on it and the goal that was scored well worth another look Lee has been one-sided but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going Sergio Roberto Lionel Messi it is a decent looking attack here when he analyzes it you know I think he'll feel he shouldn't have taken on the shot from there well he definitely shouldn't have done the angle's all wrong he's got to look for other options Madrado. Matuidi. Janic now. Juventus keep possession and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? He has been deemed to be offside, not by much, Lee. Brilliant, brilliant officiating that is. Look at that, spot on. And they'll have to throw it back in play. Now here's Pique. Messi. And it's Busquets. 
Well, can he make this? And now, passing it through. So close to keeping himself onside, but offside is the verdict. Well, and that's his job, the linesman. Give those tight offside decisions and get them right. Now Jordi Alba. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Others in the vicinity. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? Carrying a genuine threat here. And the referee says penalty. That will certainly mean a booking here. And now he's on a tightrope. see it again I can tell you his nerves will have been jangling but he kept his nerve really good penalty and it's a tale of four goals in this match now three one it is this attack looks highly promising Got to kick it away. Well, goalkeeping adventurism here. And now Suarez. And it's Vidal. Juventus have given it away. Now Ronaldo. Effective challenge. Robbed of possession, Coutinho. Cristiano Ronaldo. Strongly in, Piquet. Given away by Barcelona. Mandzukic doing the manoeuvring. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. Matuidi Pjanic now the tackle crisp and accurate the free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona Suarez the Blaugrana have given the ball away and in with a real chance only the keeper to beat so hard to overcome Jordi Alba. And Cuadrado. And now Ronaldo. Is it going to be? And it's gone in! Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. There has been a goal in quality tonight. They've really got to give them credit let up at all. Lionel Messi. Sergio Roberto. And a strong tackle. Excellent defending. Just couldn't quite keep us in play. And Messi. And everyone in the centre looking on as it sailed over them. Matuidi losing out. Well, let's make no bones about it. This is a thorough thrashing, Lee. Well, how frustrated to us. And he's broken free. Can he beat the goalkeeper? Surely. Magnificent from Mark andre Ter Stegen. And a double substitution it's going to be. Deep corner into the centre of the area. Plattered away. Dembele. An awful lot of green space to run into. Didn't look 
great in possession then, Coutinho. Oh, it's gone in! And you have to feel for him now. It will go down as an own goal. Let's have a look at that again. All defenders look away. Nobody likes to see this. It's poor, you have to say, but it's important now that he puts his head back on and starts to concentrate on the rest of the game. So the current scoreline, 4-2. side shy about shooting in this match Italy's old lady has passed the final test Juventus are the winners of the UEFA Champions League well you have to say fully deserved as well all those months of toil the training sessions etc the sacrifice the commitment the desire the hunger the luck as well the application to put all that into a package and then win this brilliant trophy they do set very high standards for themselves these Juventus players but this is something they will remember forever what a feeling of pride it must give you to be able to say you're part of the team that's the best in Europe League well you know these players get paid fortunes bank accounts are full of money but it doesn't matter it's about memories when you finish your career you look back at these moments how many trophies have I won? How many times have I celebrated on a podium with this famous trophy? The buoyant Bianconeri. Juventus lift the Champions League trophy. Brilliant moment, especially for the captain. He gets his hands on the trophy first. Well, they certainly intend to savour this. Juventus, and they ought to. Doesn't come along every night of the week. Well, this is the moment I love sharing it with the fans. The ticket tape's coming down, the family's in the stand, giving them all away. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic. And it took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Now the chance for a photograph. My mum always told me to get on the front row. She taught you well, Lee. There we have it. The Champions League victors for 2019. And he's made headway.